Hey there guys, welcome to uh, the next part of my gameplay walkthrough of Star Fox Adventures. Now let's find out where we were last time. Nice, 19% of the way through the game. Alright, we bought the Zoom goggles from the Thorntail store, returned to the Snowhorn Wastes, and rescued Snowhorn Gatekeeper, who opened the portal to Dark Ice Mines. Alright, let's head back. Okay, so now we have to go back to Th uh, Thorntail Hollow and uh, head to Dark Ice Mines, but before that, there's something I want to show you here. I have to jump on this platform here. Oh wait, uh, I know. There's, see, there's another cheat token um, over here. Just wondering if there's any more scarabs around here. Oh. Alright. Fuel cell here. Like it. All right. Let's see if there's any scarabs in here. A little later, then. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to head back to Thorntail Hollow. Make sure I have some scarabs um, for next time. I just have to switch the flow of water again. Stay. Say to board the Arling. 
You have enough fuel cells to reach Dark Ice Mines. Press A to return to orbit and select a new mission. Or press B to remain on Dinosaur Planet. So if you have anything else uh, left to do on the planet, then go for it and then return here. Otherwise, press A to return to orbit. We can see the Dark Ice Mines has been unlocked, so let's head there. This ramp here. There is at least one bat here, so keep your eyes open. There. Okay. Have to go over at the right moment. Five holes going to hit you. Okay. Whoa. Well, uh, <laughs> forgot about that bit. Alright, now we're in the main area. Snowballs here. Find a way into the mine, but beware the Galden. Alright. Another sharp cut here. Find a way into the mine, yeah. So it's the same thing as the other snow hole. Oh. 
Can you help me get free? Okay, I'm on it. Um, first thing is to, for Tricky to dig his way through here. Sharp claws. Pick up these uh, rock tops. Okay. Got an item in a new container here. This is a shackle key. Use it to unlock Snowborn Leg Shackles. Alright, so now we can free the Snowborn outside. This is a bridge cog. If you find the machine that it fits, then you'll be able to open a new route. Alright, um... So, well... These things have a little bit of a habit of uh, jumping out when you least expect it. There's another one here somewhere, yeah. Alright, so... Uh, yeah. Stone ladder here. Okay. Alright, there's some more creatures inside the those rocks. So be careful. Right now we can place the bridge pub here. And activate the switch to the left. Got a bridge. Okay. Oh, yeah. They do come back every now and again. Uh, there's a larger creature somewhere here. Two sharp claws here. Torment some another snowball. Command. 
Go on, youngster. Give it a go. If I wasn't so exhausted, I could help you through the main gates. I need some food. All right, now that we've found out about Flame, uh, Tricky's Flame Command. Back over here. There's this ice wall to melt, along with a couple of others. Where is he? Come on, Tricky. Look at this, flame! Now stand back, because if you're in the path of this flame, then it'll bake you. There's a bass here. Nice. Use Clicky's train command here. Flame! To light the small fire. direction every few seconds. Flame. Some more rock tops here. Nice. I'm gonna feed a few to tricky. I'm stuck. And pick these up. Right. Fine. 
This is where the second Alpine route is. So now we can return to the snowball. Oh. Alpine Ritz. Center of the platform until it says climb on. Press A. Alright. Now we can say A says Tusk attack. But we just have to wait until we're at the gate. When you're close enough, press A. platform over here. Press A to climb off. Slide down. There's another cannon here so uh, which fires every few seconds so be careful. Accidentally hit tricky there. Right um yeah, I think. Break this ice wall over here. Flame. Oh. Nice. Uh, boost pad. platform by platform. Just make sure you don't go too far too fast, otherwise you'll fall off and have to go all the way back. control of a sharp claw cannon. Use the control stick to aim the cannon and hold A to fire. The longer you hold down A, the further you can shoot. Each shot will use power from your staff energy meter. Alright, so we've got five sharp claws in all to take out. Oh, too far. Ah. Just hit the snow horn as well as one of the sharp claws. Nice. Yeah, one over there. 
Alright, that's all of them. Alright, life force doors open. One more thing to do. Okay, uh, there's three bridge cogs that we need to get in the item boxes that we saw before. The uh, first one is just here. This is a bridge cog. If you find the machine that it fits, then you'll be able to open a new route. Exactly what it said uh, the last time we got one. Alright, here's the second one. Tricky's playing command <laughs> to get through. Now we have all three. Machine that they're going is back this way. Um, the way that uh, we went towards the Sharp Claw Cannon. Alright, so instead of using the boost pad, turn right to find the machine. You have to select the right card for the right place. And last one. I just activated the machine the same way as the last one. And we have a second bridge. to go the wrong way then. <laughs> Never mind. Right. Find secrets. Yeah. Come on, Tricky, I need you. Yeah, you 
in here something. In there. Beyond the leap of faith lies an ancient prize. Right. Need to get through to it. Right. Um, I'm gonna get these grubs up first. game here in the middle, or a small side mission if you will. Right, so, um, one tactic to use here is to have the flame command assigned to the Y button. Uh, if you'll need it throughout this game. Right. When you're ready, shoot that switch up there. And you have one minute. To light all four of those flames up there. Flame. Flame. You might think that you're stuck, but you're not. Just head forward. <laughs> That's because the legend mentioned a leap of faith. Right. Small icicle here. Wait for Tricky and then use the plane command again. This is the dinosaur horn. If you find a horn pad on the ground, you can use this horn to call for help. Right, now let's head back out. Because up ahead is a very strong blizzard and Fox can't make it through on his own. Right again, stand in the center, climb on. And head into the blizzard. Right, to guide the snowhorn through the blizzard, he will need to be fed alpine roots as you explore. 
look on the ground and walk over them to eat. You can see one of them ahead of us, just barely. And it's best to keep on going until you've uh, walked over the alpine roofs before you turn. This alpine route on the right, you can get it if you want to, but now turn to the left, because if you carry on going up that path, then it'll lead you right back to the start. Either that or you get lost. I've never been down that way, so... Right? Now we're at the end of the blizzard. Tricky! Tricky! Your friend will turn up! Uh, they usually do. Maybe I can help until he does. All right. So for the moment, we have to do without Tricky. All right. Before you leave the snow horn, use its tusk attack to take out that um, blockade. I'm trying to find the right word there. Right. Press A to climb off. Right now, a couple of shark claw here. All right, so we can see another life force door there with two spirits on it. Oh, <laughs> I was in the bonfire. Well, I was in the fire. Um, all right, life force doors open. Okay, recharge my health just a bit. Um, yeah, this way. Now we come across another jet bike. Alright, let's go. There's no shark claws to get in front of here. So, just enjoy the ride. And head down to the other side. Staff energy gems coming off now. Somewhere. There they are. Flamethrowers here, as you can see. Hold down R to activate the shield from the staff to make it through without trouble. And then hit. Come out the other end, right into a shark door. Oh, two of them. To go. I haven't played this part of the game for a bit, so yeah, that's Tricky's voice, so we found him. Yep, use the boost pad to get up here, and through 
this place. Follow that uh, rolling ball all the way down. Uh, nice. Use the rocket boost. Oh, it's not the rocket boost, the fire blaster. Hit the switch, stop the flamethrower, and we'll get a new item. This is a Shark Claw Prison Cell Key. Alright. Head back up here. Use the shield to make the ball go right through you. Alright. Head back through to the main area. Here. Be careful of the flight for long and flame throwers. Right. Now we come over to the prison cells over here. Uh, Tricky's in this one. Use the silver key to get him out. Press A to talk to him and he'll explain what happened. Fox! I lost you in the blizzard! Some shark clothes found me and threw me in that stinky cell! Alright, but now we're going back. Alright. Make your way back to the main area. You can leap over the gap. Alright. And again. Keep using the staff shield to protect yourself from the flame throws. Flame. Another item box there. is a sharp claw prison selfie. The other one was silver, this one's gold. Uh, but again, you can use it to warm up the other cell. Whoa, Whoa. okay. <laughs> I need to slow down a bit. <laughs> Alright, now we can use the other key to unlock the other cell. And now we've freed another snowball. Who are you? I am Fox, and this is the Crown Prince of the Earthwalkers. We've been sent by the Snowhorn Gatekeeper to find the Spellstone. Do you know where it's hidden? My name is Belina Tay. The Gatekeeper is my father. Did he send you to rescue me? I'm sorry, Belina, but he feels you have betrayed the beliefs of the gatekeepers. We were only sent to find the spellstone. The old fool. I had to save the tribe. If it wasn't for my father being a gatekeeper, none of this would have happened in the first place. Okay. 
Okay, first thing you need to do to get to the bottom of the mine is to get a hole into that wall. There's another creature here. Oh. In case it went that happens. Okay. It is slippery here, so. We're just up to the upper level. Okay, there is a bass up here somewhere. Yeah. Uh, okay, again, I was getting a bit ahead of myself. I need to go back down. And again, it didn't work. Oh, yeah. There's uh, three icicles up here that you need to shoot. To create footholds in, in these waters. There's another one that I can't see from here. There it is. Alright, we've got him. Make your way over to this switch. Now he goes to the upper platform. Oh, here he is again. platforms to get from this side to the other. One step at a time. Now we need to go up to that ledge now. Look is to get this one down to the walls of the low. Uh, hey, you know, easiest way to get down without causing damage is to land in the water. But careful not to stay in there too long. Yeah. Yeah, there was a ladder there, but I find it easier and quicker just to jump down. Alright. There's a couple of sharp claw at the bottom level here. Oh. I got burned by the fire again. I think I was that close. Alright. Yeah, a few more scatters. Alright. Now down here. There's more flamethrowers here, so again, activate the shield to get through easily. All 
right now we're at the bottom. Melina, you made it! It hasn't been easy. Now where is that spellstone? My father didn't say exactly where it was, but he knew that General Scales had hidden it somewhere close. Look carefully. I'm sure you and your little friend can find it before they do. Time is short! You must find the spellstone! Again, the small shark claw down here. Alright. We now need to come to the ladder over on this side. There's uh, four and fuel barrels there. Uh, took care of the shark claw for me, but also caused some damage to me as well. Oh, no. They're actual barrels, uh, not flame barrels, or fuel barrels, I should say. Okay, pick one of the fuel barrels up. And make it pass, so make it up to the other side of this bridge. As you can see, these barrels head left and right, they go from one side to the other. Oh. Okay. Messed up a bit there. Right. Yeah. Just have to go to the opposite side to those barrels. Keep an eye on when. Uh, or exactly where on the bridge that they change places. So you have to go to the opposite side. Otherwise, what happens to me just then will happen again. Alright. Right. Alright, we're at the top now. Um, yeah, there's a pad somewhere where you can put the uh, barrel down. Oh, it's over here. Yeah. Make sure the A display says to put down, otherwise you'll end up throwing it and you'll have to go back and get another one. Um, I think now you're at, yeah, head up the ladder. Yeah, you got another cannon firing at you now, so uh, just be careful. Activate the switch. And that machine will bring the barrel up to the, the level that you're on. Right. Now we transport it over to this side. Wait for the flame to go out. Oh. Uh, yeah, over here. Go all the way around. Blow another crack in the wall here. Activate the switch. And now we've got the first of two uh, paths that have been um, opened. There's the other one to the right. Place. But we'll get to that in time. Let's make our way back down the ladder. Right to where the rolling barrels are. Make sure none of them hit you. Just waiting for the rolling balls to pass. 
so that none of them hit me. Alright, and here on the left we have another switch. Uh, there's the second path that's opened up and it leads to a cannon. That's our next stop. throws and then up another ladder. There's another shark floor up here as well. Okay. Take control of the cannon. See the X on the boards up over on the uh, stone pillar there? You need to hit that. There's half of the foothold there that we need to go past to get to the next area. There's two of these, here's the other one. continue on in the next part of this walkthrough so see you all there